Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today I'm going to go over the uh, fantasy cards, the divisional, or no, not the divisional, the conference championship uh, round. Uh, there's only four cards, uh, only three that you can pull in packs, and of course the one that you do the collection against. So let's go over them. Two Seahawks, two Broncos, uh, pretty standard. Let's see here, player, fantasy. Let's see here, I think. All of them, no, 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 two offense and two defense. So we'll start out with the two Seahawks guys. Which the first one here is Doug Baldwin, uh, wide receiver, 93 overall, uh, 5K, which is pretty darn cheap for him. Uh, there are his stats; they're pretty good. Awareness is a little low, and release is a little low, but all in all, he's pretty good for 5K. Um, easy pickup if you're a Seahawks fan. Or looking for a cheap, good wide receiver. He's he's up there. Oops, wrong. Yeah, no, no. Cam Chancellor's strong safety. I was right. Uh, 19k for Cam Chancellor. Um, I saw somebody compare the stats for him. He doesn't look. It doesn't look like he's that much of an improvement uh, over the other Cam Chancellor. So there are his stats. Nothing that pops out. It's like uber amazing. 90 speed and 90 zone. That's pretty good. Awareness is a little low, but. Uh, that's not a bad card to get if you want uh, a new safety or something to try out. Uh, not awful. And then let's move on to the Broncos players. Let's see here. <laughs> Gotta get to Broncos. There's Broncos. Terrence Knighton, 5K, 92 overall. Uh, let's see here. 73 speed. That's not bad for a D tackle. 94 block shed's pretty good. 93 power move. 96 strength. He's got some good stats. If you're looking for a new D tackle or uh, just want to try out something different, he's pretty good. And then finally is the Demarius Thomas, which is the collection one. Let's go team of the week. There he is. Four collectibles. Um, I'll give you kind of a rough estimate on the prices. Uh, I think Terrence Knight and I pulled one yesterday, as you saw in that video uh, that I uploaded. Uh, I think I, I sold that for 45 It's probably down a little bit. I pulled this one today and sold it for 23 And I think that one's 30 but I'm not sure. That one you obviously get from doing the soul challenges. I can just look up the Doug Baldwin one. Uh, but I, I, it'll probably cost you like 70, 80k to do it, which isn't bad, which isn't bad whatsoever. Let's see your Seahawks. Uh, no, which one was it? It's the huge catch one. Ah, there we go. For 42k. So if the other one's still at 40k. That's uh, about 100k for that Demarius Thomas, which isn't bad, but you can also wait until... I'm not sure how long these will be in. I don't know if they're going to do like a Pro Bowl fantasy type thing, or if they're just going to wait till the Super Bowl or something, or if those are the last ones. I'm not sure. And if they are the last ones, I wonder when they come out. And then finally, I have one thing to show you guys. I'm starting a little collection, um, and what that is is going to be numbered cards that are the same number as the player's jersey. Uh, so I bought this Keenan Allen when it came out. It is number 13 out of 100, and he's obviously number 13, as you can see on his jersey. Uh, didn't really want the card, but when I saw 13 out of 100 on the auction, I jumped on it because it's always cool to have the players, uh, the numbered card that's also the player's jersey. So pick that up, and then you guys know I've had this Joe Hayden for a while, uh, and it's 23 out of 100. Uh, the other numbered cards I do have... Um, Julian Edelman and Shane Vereen are the two other numbered cards. They're not the right number. Edelman's number three and Vereen's number 11. Uh, but if anybody has any numbered cards that are the same number as their jersey on Xbox One, hit me up, uh, let me know, and maybe we can work out a deal or something or I can buy it or whatever. Uh, but that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.